Troy. This is uh, Alex and uh, the painter. So, um, but basically remodeled my whole house and Alex did all of the painting for the, of the interior. The ceiling here had a popcorn ceiling and um, after the popcorn was removed, it's gotta be sanded and skim coated. And uh, as you can see, there's very, um, very to little and no uh, imperfections. It's very smooth. Uh, it's hard to find a good uh, skim coater that will do uh, like a mirrored type finish like this. It's very smooth. And so that's what he did in this room. And then uh, we got around the corner there, we got the living room with some painting work that he did there as well. Okay, uh, this is the living room and the loft all connection, connected in one big room basically uh, that the ceiling is. Again, Alex removed the, uh, the popcorn ceiling and had scaffolding up here and everything and skim coated it. And uh, you see this chip in this fireplace mantle here. Alex was uh, doing some removal of the popcorn and kind of slipped off the scaffolding and chipped the <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> this here is all uh, custom work by uh, by somebody else, but uh, but um, you know, he's, Alec does. He doesn't cause any damage to the property. Actually, uh, you know, you hire some of these people. They come in and uh, you know they, they damage the property in some way or the other. Nicks, scratches, or whatever. Uh, and the ceiling up there, there's a there's a, a, a mark, but that was from uh, some work I was doing in the attic, some insulation. You know, that's just an example how damage can occur when you hire someone. But Alex, uh, you know, aside from doing a good job on painting and the skim coating and stuff, um, you know, painting. takes takes care of the yeah painting and you know takes care of the uh, uh, the property. It doesn't cause any damage or anything. You can see the the paint color on the walls and in the city, the whole thing, the crown mold. And the shine, the stairs. Yeah, it's good. It's good. Uh, it's hard to find good good work these days, you know. <laughs> Actually, you don't know who you're gonna uh, hire. You know, I've had some other work done here, and I was well. This guy was gonna do some drywall work in the loft after I built the loft, and he couldn't get a the, the ceiling. Um, he couldn't install it drywall and skim coat it or uh, tape it and uh, actually I called Alex afterwards to come and fix it. I don't know why I called him in the first place. I didn't think he did drywall work but I guess you do right? Yes sir. Yeah okay but yeah and so that was just a lesson learned that I had somebody here they were doing some work on the ceiling there and they, they were I finally just said okay you gotta leave you just you don't you're not gonna be able to, to do this you just don't have not capable of doing it. So and I called Alex and he fixed it actually. Okay, Mr. Troy. Okay. Thanks so much. Yeah.